Finley was the other team in the top four last year, and the thing I keep hearing about the Trojans is that they're tough. They, they are a tough team to play again. There's another team that didn't lose a lot from last year's team, only uh, had a handful of seniors that are now gone off of that roster. They always have big numbers. Matt, that's one great thing that we see out of Finley. Every year they have numbers. They got good goaltending, solid goaltenders, uh, both, both of them there. One uh, that was a freshman last year, now be a sophomore this year. They have a solid team, and they always play everybody tough. You want to you get into a tight checking game, you don't want to do it with Finley. No, Whitey and Nat and Milsner, they have a good yep. defense. They only graduated two real significant seniors from last year, but Mike Armstrong is the guy that makes it go. And you're right, when they have numbers like you do in Finley, they got a solid JV team and a solid varsity team. Why? Because it's one of the biggest high schools in Ohio. People don't know that, Finley High School. So they got great numbers there, and it is the work ethic. Now, that's a team that is used to winning two to one, three to two type games. They can open it up this year, Matt. They have the offense, they have the pace this year. Expect Finley to play some four to three games, five, three, six, four even. This is a different type of Finley team. They believe they have the offense, but you know at the end of the year you have to be able to shut it down and how you play defensively is gonna carry in the state tournament. But they're gonna be a much more fun team to watch.